Hey everyone, welcome to episode seven of Countdown to Splash. Again, Jason Webster, CEO of Archetype, here with Thomas Turrison, one of our OneStream architects. Uh, so Thomas, thanks for joining me. Yeah, thanks. Looking forward to it. Great. So we want to learn a little bit more about you. So if you could give us kind of a little bit of your background and how you landed up in this CPM space. Yeah, no, I've been uh, been in this, like many of our colleagues, in uh, this uh, CPM analytics space for over 20 years now as a consultant. And uh, uh, I got my start working in uh, uh, performance management, really, at working at Hyperion, uh, like many of us has uh, done as well. Right. And then uh, moved on from there through Oracle and, uh, and other consultant firms as well. I uh, started actually working for Hyperion in Stockholm, Sweden, about oh, wow. 20 years ago now. And then um, you have a strong analytics background in addition to performance management, right? Yeah, actually, before that, I, I got started in uh, for, a, for a Boston-based company, actually, but in Stockholm, Sweden, called Cambridge Technology Partners, working yeah, in- CTP. <laughs> CTP, exactly. Uh, started working with um, um, some of the uh, SQL-based uh, query tools that were available at the time. And that's kind of how I got started with uh, with Hyperion as well, because Hyperion, I, I worked with a tool prior to Hyperion called Brio that yeah. uh, Hyperion acquired. So I got- uh, uh, got in uh, that way to Hyperion, and then of course expanded into the full platform of uh, of Hyperion back then with uh, with SBase and all the other reporting tools as well. Cool. When I worked for um, Painted Word way back in the day, a Hyperion partner, I I'm pretty sure their Cambridge office of CTP was one floor down from us. So again, very small world. It is a small world for sure. We probably rode the even elevator together. Yeah, exactly. Long Even ago. worldwide, it's a small world. <laughs> exactly. All right. So next question is, you've touched a lot of technology, Hyperion, Brio, you name it. Uh, talk through the moment at which you realized that OneStream was a platform that was going to work and stick around and be a place you wanted to kind of dig in. Exactly. No, the uh, uh, one thing, uh, one of the uh, projects that we started, uh, which is actually the, the solution we're going to be presenting at Splash and more on that later. Oh, cool. Um, we, uh, when we started designing that solution and the, the customer just bought one stream and um, we uh, started looking at the, the amounts of data that we we're going to be having to fill the solution in. And traditionally with a, a CPM or EPM type solution, yeah. historically, loading in transactional level data has a lot of issues and a yeah, lot a of uh, adds, adds a lot of complexity to, to a solution. But with uh, one stream being so uh, extremely flexible as a platform and the ability to combine seamlessly combine like transactional relational data with cube um, heavily like uh, model cube data for the right. financial model uh, opened up the solution to become a an amazing uh, solution where we combine both this the, the both sets of data in a, in a seamless way. So I think that was really the the, the eye opener was the that ability to have uh, relational uh, detailed transactional massive amounts of data uh, in a plat in a EPM CPM type platform. Yeah, I mean you think through all the solutions we build and you know financial reporting is important, but when you're really digging in to drive real value, it's it's you need to be able to get down to the de detail below the cubes, right? It's it's a, it, it, exactly, and not team. all not all data belongs in a cube, but the ability to be able to combine that to the end user, yeah. they don't know if the cube data is it's if it's cube data or relational data, but uh, the solution then uh, it makes for a much more powerful solution, and that yeah, was absolutely. a real eye opener, I think. So, what are you looking forward to in August at Splash? Well, first, actually getting out again, uh, <laughs> the, right. getting to, to meet um, uh, clients, potential clients, uh, old and new colleagues. As yeah. you said, it's a small world, so we're probably going to bump into quite a few people from back in the Hyperion days. Most people have moved over to one stream. So really looking forward to that. Um, excited to uh, learn and uh, visit as many of the uh, presentations as possible uh, to pick up new ideas and yeah. 
just learned and, and also really excited about sharing our experience uh, in one of the presentations that we're doing for uh, the, the custom revenue uh, recognition solution that we built for this client. So yeah, that was on, on, on Thursday, I think that one. Yes. Okay. Yeah, so we're seven really, weeks really away excited about from that. Uh, kickoff and looking forward to that. I'll see you there in person and I'm sure we'll talk a lot between now and then, but thanks for jumping on. Definitely, thanks. Cheers.